Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to the Mini Channel. Today we're going to be doing a video that I've been wanting to do some time uh, because I find it not only interesting but also something that I'm kind of curious on, on how people sit on this aspect. So, uh, one of the bigger things that have changed since Persona uh, 2 is the fact that Persona games now have this type of mascot. Now, the, the idea of a mascot isn't new in, in games, isn't new in Japanese games or RPGs or anything like that. It's actually something very common that we see it all the time. Final Fantasy has a mascot, uh, the Chocobo, uh, or we can uh, grasp many, many different examples out there all these different characters uh, or games have a mascot to it uh, persona is not the exception or just like Shin Megami Tensei in general which has the mascot of um, Jack Frost uh, persona each persona game persona 3 4 and 5 had this mascot now persona 3 sits in a weird spot because the official mascot was Aegis who now was kind of switched over to Koro the dog now persona uh, Four had Teddy, and then Persona Five had uh, Morgana. Now the question today is: Should Persona Six continue this trend of mascots, or is this something actually needed at all? Now, I probably some people will probably disagree on this, but I actually don't really like the idea of a mascot too much. I think the mascots are fine, and they're funny, and they're fun, and whatever. Uh, they don't never really, they never really see it as important plot characters, even though they actually are. Most of the time in the Persona games, they actually see a pretty important aspect of plot point of the story. They are pretty relevant to the game overall. However, I never really find them to be like that. It yeah. I don't one, I don't, I don't think of them as it, the it thing, and uh, sometimes they're either goofy or not, just not really interesting to overall. Like Teddy, although he's a really interesting character, I find him really annoying and, and kind of like a character that I don't really want to hang out with him. Um, another thing that I notice is uh, Teddy and Morgana, particularly their uh, social links or their confidant is actually an, an automatic one. You don't actually get to choose when you hang out with these characters or anything, or like other characters. This, there are their confidence is completely tied into the plot of the game and in fact in that aspect you actually get to progress with them and everything like that it's an interesting concept and um, it's something cool unique uh, but I don't think that it works really well now, uh, some people may argue that they actually like the aspect because of the goofiness and it adds kind of this personality to the game and everything. And I can see that um, uh, being an argument. However, it doesn't really sit for me well at all. And it's just, uh, just kind of there, you know, it's just not really a point. Um, it's just something that I feel like they could definitely rework somehow into the games. How they can fix that, I'm not particularly sure. I think that this is something that um, either character, either just having no uh, mascot or having a mascot that has almost no relevance and just be kind of like the mascot of the game, like Pikachu, for example, in Pokemon. Uh, even though Pikachu is a character in the Pokemon games. It doesn't. It doesn't really. It's not relevant to anything at all, or anything like that. So um, maybe something like that could work. You know, just a mascot character or something that shows up there that is kind of part of the game. Um, I don't know. I just don't really like the idea of a mascot being there, kind of like a front center part of the plot point, important to the story and everything. And the mascot just being somebody super annoying, somebody you just don't really want to actually spend time with. It's just uh, kind of flat out annoying really anyway that is pretty much it for today guys in this discussion video let me know in the comments below what you want i particularly don't care for mascots so i don't really want one but i can see some people really enjoying the mascots and actually like the designs and everything the designs are cool though i want to say that however it just it just doesn't really work for me they don't really work too much for me anyway that's it for today guys if you're new please consider liking and subscribing and i'll see you guys next time